Virginia Beach police say someone is going door to door using their name to scam innocent victims. The unwanted solicitor hit several businesses last week, claiming he needed money to help needy officers and their families. Tell your size, Jason Marks is here with how you can protect yourself from becoming a victim. Jason? Nicole, it is so easy to become a victim, and police say there's someone out there who's using police officers as the focus of his schemes. You can say, be at a salon in Virginia Beach. <laughs> That's funny. Has a bit of a neighborhood charm. Oh, it's, you know, very nice little salon. There's a ton of us that work here. A place to relax and lighten your load. She's been doing my hair about three, four years now. Angie is about. Angie Davenport is the business's owner. I love my job. I've been behind this chair over 35 years, and I love it. And with any salon, you never know who's going to walk through that door. Looking at him, I would have probably said he was an honest guy. Dirt Why not? On, the stranger was dressed wearing a hat and a sweatshirt that read police. Yeah, it was crazy. It was bizarre. Odd because the man wasn't there for a cut. He was asking for money, claiming he was collecting under the name Virginia Police Chiefs for officers who were struggling during tough times. And when Angie told him no, that's when things got hairy. So I said, you know, sir, I'm sorry, but, you know. And then, yeah, then he started badgering the client, so I told him, I'm like, sir, you have to leave now. The man left this flyer where to send the cash, a name, address, and number, none of them local. Virginia Beach detectives believe he's running a scam. Yeah, it could have very easily anybody, any of us in here could have fallen for it. The encounter has left the business still buzzing. <laughs> now they're just trying to focus yeah, my hair right. on what's important. The perfect dude. You look like a brand Absolutely. new man. Absolutely. Now, police don't want anyone to stop giving to worthy causes. They just want to make sure you know who you're giving to. There is an actual Virginia Police Chief Foundation. They say they are not going door to door. They even put a scam alert on their website. You can find a lot more information on how to protect yourself at wavy.com. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.